What's up guys and welcome back to Poker Night. I've got a five card poker game for you tonight and it's called Fish in the Barrel. Uh, it's a pretty fun game. Uh, there's a big twist on the last card. It's going to be dealt two down, three up. Keep watching. I'm going to show you how to play it and deal it. So here's how you play and deal Fish in the Barrel. Start with a shuffle deck of cards. Determine your ante. I'm going to say the ante is a quarter. Each one of these chips is worth a quarter. <coughs> Once the ante is good, you're going to deal all players two down cards. And then betting action is going to go clockwise around the table because there's no face cards right now. So betting action is going to go left of dealer, be this player right here. Take a look and see what he has. And we'll say he's going to bet a quarter. Take a look at this guy's cards. And he's going to call. And let's see what the dealer has. And the dealer's going to call. Once the pot's good, deal all players one up card. And now betting action is going to go to highest card on the table, which is the dealer. And dealer's going to bet a quarter on that queen. And the rest of the table is just going to call. Give everyone their second up card. Once again, dealer showing high hand with the queen six suited. And dealer's going to go a quarter. And the rest of the table just call. Pot's good. Give everyone their third and final up card. And dealer just hit a pair of queens. So of course dealer is going to bet a quarter. Everybody's going to call. Now here's why it's called fish in the barrel. You take your the remaining deck of cards, and if you normally you have a little bit bigger poker table when I'm using, but you're going to put a big kind of round circle in the middle of the table. Something like that right there. And now the dealer is going to go clockwise around the table and ask each player if they want to hold or if they want to fish. If they want to hold, uh, they just hold the cards they have, nothing happens, and they kind of just pass on to the next player. If they want to fish, then whatever the ante is, is how much it costs them to fish. So we'll say this player here, he's going to, he's going to take a fish. So the ante is a quarter. It's going to cost him a quarter to throw in the pot. And if you guys want to do a double or something, you guys go right ahead. Now, be, being only a five card game, you can easily say, you know, to get a fish is double the ante. But I'm just going to do uh, whatever the ante is, which is a quarter. So what he has to do is he can only throw away one of these three face cards. So he throws it away first. He's going to throw away this one. This gets mixed into the pile. Now this is where some fun things can happen. And I've seen it happen uh, mostly playing with about six or seven guys. Is they, they want to take a fish, they pay, you know, whatever you guys want to determine. And then they pull out that exact same card. Uh, you're going to get a heck of a lot of laughs uh, around the table. We have them discard, mix it in, and then that player is going to pull out another card of his choice. He reaches in, pulls out a seven. Uh, probably really didn't help him much, but that's what happens. This player over here, dealer just asked, do you want to hold or you want to fish? And he's going to get rid of that free three, so he's going to fish it. So this gets thrown away first, mixed into the pile. This player here, he's going to draw, and he fishes out a 10. So he improved his hand quite a bit. Dealer, let's see what he's got there. Dealer's got, you know, a decent hand, but he's going to fish as well. Be nice for him to pick up another pair or another queen. There's one out right here. 
So dealer pays the pot. This is kind of how you get the pot a little bit bigger. So pot's a decent size. This is a five card game. I've only got three hands out. And especially when you get a lot of people buying their cards, you know, you got six guys uh, playing and you got, you know, maybe four of them buying cards. You can get the pot built up pretty good. The dealer's going to throw away the six. And this six gets mixed into the, we'll call that a fish bowl. And dealer's going to pull out a card. And pulls out an ace. Prove the hand a little bit, not too much. So now you have another betting round because everyone has, well, most everyone has new uh, high cards on the table. If you're playing with, you know, six guys and half held, half drew, chances are someone's going to have a better hand on the table. So now that's, that's where the next betting round comes up. So we got queen 10 over here, jack 10, dealer still has these pair of queens. So the dealer's... Got a chance to bet, and he's just going to bet a quarter. And a lot of times, we'll just say the table's going to call. On five card games, on the last bet, uh, sometimes we go um, max bet. We'll raise like the max bet, like uh, quarter ante, uh, max bet is a dollar on the last card. And you can build up the pot uh, a little more that way too with these five card hands. You just make sure you announce that before you deal it. But he just went a quarter. Table's called. No more cards to go out. Everybody can just we can say one, two, three, flip, whatever you want to do. See who has the best hand. And look at there, we got queens and a ten over here. You've got an ace jack over here. And dealer's got a pair of queens with an ace high. Almost a straight if he had a jack. So dealer's going to win the pot. Like I said, this is a good game to get a good pot out of a five card hand. Mostly, you know, five card games. The pot's kind of small. This is one that builds the pot uh, pretty good. And if you're playing with six, seven guys and someone discards, let's say they discard this eight and they pull that eight back out, I can tell you there's going to be laughs around the table. It's going to be hilarious. This is one of them card games that you can get a lot of laughs out of, which is always fun. It's always fun to win and have a kind of a fun card game that somebody does something to laugh at. So that ends the game. Hope you guys enjoyed watching this. Uh, try it out at your next uh, poker game, poker party. Comment down below and let me know what you think. Thanks for watching.